Hey guys, meteorologist Lindsay Slater here. I'm at Turner Ballroom in downtown Milwaukee and there is a huge, big event that's coming, kind of almost like a wizard prom. I'm talking about the Yule Ball and with me today is Lynn Richter with Awkward Nerd. And this is a huge event. It's the fourth year of it. It is. Uh, so we fill Turner Hall with a bunch of Harry Potter nerds, uh, <laughs> Potter heads as we like to call ourselves, and we're gonna have a really good time this weekend. So tell me a little bit about why you think that Harry Potter themed anything is such a big deal with, I guess, folks of our age, really. Uh, well, so many of us grew up with Harry Potter. I think we got immersed in the world. We picked our house. We, you know, got a Patronus. We, you know, <laughs> so many of us have even been to the Wizarding World, and you know, we've got a wand, uh, mm -hmm. and now we want to experience that in a, in a new way as adults. So. And Harry Potter is as much of a kid book series as it can be an adult book series, especially if you grew up with it like we did. So why do you think so many people want to come here and experience that? I think so many of us just really love the whole world and, and what we grew up with. It's going to be decorated. They can expect it just like Goblet of Fire. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> um, so we have a whole stage crew that creates a unique stage and a backdrop, mm -hmm. and we project images onto it. So you really feel like you've got that world experience. We have DJs. We have lighting. Everything is made to make you feel like you are a part of it. Now, I've also heard about people dressing up in costumes. So um, what... If you're a brand new person going to the U-Ball, what kind of costumes should they be dressing in? Uh, you can go as fancy as you want to. Mm -hmm. So a lot of people like to wear ball gowns. We like to uh, get involved with cosplay. Mm -hmm. We like to wear wigs, you know, uh, <laughs> color your hair, everything. Um, anything goes at Yule Ball, as long as you're part of the general theme. Okay, so again, this is going to be Friday and Saturday nights, and I'm telling you guys, they have themed drinks. There's also a couple other fun prizes, too. So we're, coming up next, we're actually going to make one of the drinks. It's, a, it's actually a classic butter beer with a twist. We'll have that coming up next.